What's up Costco shoppers, sparkling water drinkers of the Costco world. You may have noticed a uh, relatively new product on the shelves alongside the case of LaCroix sparkling water, the official non-alcoholic drink of hipsters the world over now. Don't know why. Uh, is the Kirkland Signature brand sparkling water, direct competitor. Uh, you get the same three flavors, lime, lemon, grapefruit, or pomplamoose if you want to pretend you're French. Interestingly, or maybe not so interestingly, in typical Costco fashion, you get more for less. Uh, I think the LaCroix is 24 cans and the Kirkland is like 30 or 32 cans for even cheaper and I don't remember what it is like $14 or something uh, I was planning on doing this video when I first got the cases but instead I just drank a bunch of it and now all I have left is is one of each flavor um, you get the least grapefruits and you get more of the limes and the the lemons uh, which kinda sucks if you like grapefruit like me but that's the way it goes anyway they're not the same, they're different. I've tried them all and they are significantly, you know, to where anyone I think can, can taste the difference. I don't really know which one I like better. Um, so we're gonna do a blind taste test and see how it goes. And just to up the hipster factor a little bit, we're gonna be sampling them out of mason jars because why not? You're comparing Kirkland lemon to LaCroix lemon. You just don't know which is which. What do you think about that one? That's the Kirkland one. That's the Kirkland one. Oh no. Yeah. This has just got almost no F sparkling quality to it. I think it's just weaker all around. Weaker all around. So no clear preference. No, I prefer this. You prefer one. that one. Okay. For sure. All right. Oh. You're ready. You're up. All right. This there's, is lemon. There's something in the bottom of this there's one. There's oh. lemon. Oh, you put B on there. Okay. All right. So I'm doing this one. This is lemon, lemon, huh? Okay. They're both lemon. Scent. Now, Scent. I, think, I want everything. Yeah. Scent. I think yeah. like taste testing beer, unlike wine, it should be quaffed. Not sipped like a wine, right? To really get the whole thing. Cause, and that was, I love the effervescence. Um, I think if, did you say it was lime? It tastes like lime, yeah? It's lemon. Ooh. Lemon lime, it's all the same, Chef. You don't have to drink them all. That's very good. It's very I good. I liked it. Very that refreshing. Very good. Should I cleanse my palate with some wine? No. <laughs> it might actually be an interesting concept. All right. Bubbles feel smaller. Smaller bubbles. Yes. This is number A. Nowhere near as uh, citrusy. I think I like uh, B, which was the first B. one. B. Better, yeah. Okay. That prefers B. And we're back with lime this time. How do you feel about lime? I like it. You like lime in general? Yeah, oh yeah. Okay. Here she goes with A. I think this is the Kirkland one. She thinks it's the Kirkland one. This has got more lime flavor. I think I that prefer one. this one. Okay, B. It's got stronger lime smell. Lime, stronger smell. Stronger smell. Yeah, this is a this is better. Okay, right. this is lime. This is oh, lime. I do two sets. There's two Left. of three flavors that you have to do. Okay, I'm gonna guess this is the same brand as A was the last time because the bubbles are bigger and it's got more effervescence, you know, more bubbles in total. This is uh, this is B. B. Now. Okay. Again, okay, uh, less effervescence. The bubbles like you know feel small, but there's just not that much uh, carbonation. There's less noticeably. Mm -hmm. And again. I would say the, the flavor is not as strong as the first one. As, so as, 
You prefer the stronger flavor mm -hmm. of mm -hmm. A? Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. So we saved the, our, what, our favorite flavor for last. Sure. Pompe mousse. Oh, wow. This is quite grapefruity. Quite grapefruity. And this it smells bad. I'm not drinking anymore. You're not even I'm... drinking it. That's how bad it is. Yeah, A is fine. A is great. A is fine. It's got a nice fizz, good grapefruit flavor. And the other one is just not good at all. It's Bad smell and flavor. Just wash your car with it or something. Wash your car with it. Wow. Oh, yeah. Not bad. With all right, this is the grapefruit. B first again? Or Whatever doesn't matter. order you It doesn't want. matter. Okay, doesn't so matter. this is B. All right. Grapefruit. grapefruit. Ooh. I love, when they're good, I like grapefruit better than now, the other two. I think Janet pointed out something very interesting. Don't, 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 no, 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 no. Poison just, my just, mind just, now. I would like you to do first a comparison before you taste them, just of the scent. Of the scent? Okay. Yes. Okay. Because they're extremely different. On wow. Two. Okay, that one smells really good. Very... And which one is that? This is B. That's B. Uh, I was going to say it's, you know, citrusy, but... Like citrus blossoms, ah, not like citrus leaves or skin, you know, or flesh, or the kind of more acrid, right? Yeah, yeah, and that's what it's Jenna very like perfumey, it. I'd yeah. say, yeah, like okay, a flower. That's a good okay. point. I wasn't quite sure what that was. This has got something going for it too. That's a. Yeah, but okay. it's very different than They're B. They're very different. They're very smell, different. Right? Yeah, this one is more. I I'd say, oh, this is really nice, but this is like. Perfume over here. Yeah. Okay. One is perfume and one is almost like the flesh of the grapefruit. Okay, that's good. This is A. Yep, that's uh, good. Wow. Okay, so uh, B has more uh, more carbonation. Yeah. Bigger bubbles, it feels like. Uh, it's got that perfume nose yeah. going for it. So there's definitely grapefruit flavor, but kind of, but, but, uh, the edge rolls off of it. It's mellow. Okay. Uh -huh. This one I think is more, uh, you know, more acid or acrid. You know, it's like a little bit sharper. The grapefruit. The flavor. Mm -hmm. Right. The other one is more acrid smell. Yeah. The perfume. Well, not acrid. Yeah. Well, whatever. All right. Yeah. So, which yeah. do you prefer? I like both of these, but again, well, the one with more bubbles, I like. The bubbles, and well, yeah. I also really like that nose it's got. I think it's got that so perfume maybe thing going. That you prefer. So maybe I prefer this of these two, but they're both good. Hey, they're both good. All right. Well, so, fine, folks. That about wraps it up. We'll do a little rundown. We're not going to wait for the sister because she's stuck in traffic. What a loser. Here's the results are in. Let's start with the most interesting. I oh, I think wait. is the grapefruit. Yeah, All right. That's the last one. Yeah, as Janet pointed out, and you agreed with, and I, I you know, I didn't do it blind, but they smell incredibly different. Mm -hmm. I think, like you said, the Kirkland one is more acrid and floral. Well, and I didn't put those two together. The Pomplamousse is what they call, the hipster LaCroix calls it. It smells more like what you would think the flesh of a good grapefruit smells okay, like. Okay, so... The one that I thought was perfumey is the... The Kirkland. Kirkland, okay. And I you, didn't think it was acrid. I thought I was saying it was soft. It okay. had the flavor. Well, you preferred overall like the better, Kirkland. Yeah. Oh, well, let's get this out of the way. Yeah. With all three of them, the Kirkland is, without a doubt, more effervescent. So if you like bubbles, yeah. just based on that, you might prefer so the Kirkland. It. Okay? So that was the deal. The grapefruit... Janet thinks the Kirkland grapefruit is good for cleaning a toilet bowl or something and won't touch it. That's funny. Uh, I have a comment about that. Should I reserve it for later? I like them both, but I like the fizz more on the Kirkland. All right? Let's back up to the lime. Janet also pointed out on the smell front that B... Which oh, was? you know what? I don't know if I agree. She said the LaCroix has a stronger lime smell and is less fizzy. It's definitely less fizzy. Here's the lime. Uh, uh, and what, what do I have here? That's LaCroix. This is okay, Kirkland. Yeah, I was gonna, oh, well, okay, I can smell, but I want to taste it again. So she preferred the... I can't smell the, out of the thing there like that. Well. LaCroix lime over mm -hmm. the Kirkland lime. She also preferred the LaCroix Pomplamousse 
over the Kirkland pomplamousse. Pomplamousse is the French grapefruit. Word for grapefruit. Yeah. Right. You, Dad, preferred the Kirkland lime over the Lacroix lime. So you're two for two on Kirkland, and yeah, and uh, she's two for two on. LaCroix right now. Interesting. Now. Maybe it's a male female thing. On to the lemon. Let me make sure I get this right. On the lemon. Janet preferred the Kirkland. Ah. And I think upon review of the video, pretty, pretty significantly preferred it. Um, and you prefer the LaCroix. Mm. So you guys well, disagreed thought, on every single one of them. But now I thought that's that's very very interesting. Did you realize that as we were going along, Janet? No, because you didn't know. It was blind. Um, and he hadn't done the reveal yet. No. Uh, uh, but I thought that each one of the ones I liked better had the more fizz. No. Okay. Well, let me try. Mm. Give me those ones that where I chose the Lacroix. You chose. For the, for, that was for the grapefruit? You chose LaCroix for the lemon. For the it has lemon. less fizz. Okay. I said it had less fizz though? Here, where's the, give me the lemon. Double fisting. Uh, give me the lemon for the uh, Kirkland. Here it is. Kirkland lemon. You know what? They're all good. I, I, just mix them all together. <laughs> uh, with, now, the price. Oh. Where you get them on sale or whatever. I forget. LaCroix. So I threw away my receipt because I hate BPA. Um, and I didn't make a note of it, but the LaCroix you get 24 cans and you get like You know, they give you way more lemons and limes in both of them than the grapefruit oh, I don't know if they think mix. Yeah, you I don't know buy. if they think people like it more or they think that the grapefruit is like worth more So they should give you less but either way whether you get Kirkland or LaCroix you get Predominantly lemons and limes and and you know a handful of grapefruits thrown in but yeah It's like a 24 pack of LaCroix and like a 32 pack of Kirkland and the Kirkland is like a dollar cheaper or something like that. It's way more for for less mm. So I would suggest if you're a sparkling water fan Buy them both and find out for yourself and <laughs> stop watching stupid YouTube videos get a life get a fucking life get off of YouTube